what's up guys welcome to another video on my channel in today's video I'm gonna show you how to install parallels on your M1 MacBook I would really appreciate if you subscribe because it supports me a lot with the work that I'm doing and yes let's start with the quick guide um, so there's now support for parallels desktop you just go to parallel like you can just type it into google parallels desktop and then you're gonna see down here parallels m1 tech preview just click it then you can make a free account you can try the technical preview and after you've done that um, it shows you automatically where that you can download it here and it gives you also a free activation key then the next thing the next step is you have to download the Windows Insider preview um, because you have an ARM processor, so it's a special Windows edition. Um, the best is if you just make a Windows Insider um, account and then you can uh, download it really easy. So then you're gonna double click Parallels, you're gonna open it, and then the first thing you're gonna see is it's, give you, it's giving you like an introduction um, just click continue it automatically found already the ex existing um, file from the Windows 10 ARM edition then you just say create it's gonna take a little while to create and then you can sign in here with your Parallels um, account that you have just created and then after that you can use the activation key that you also just received um, then it's just gonna configure everything you have to allow the access to your computer it's gonna take a little while And there we are. It will just configure in the background and stuff, but I will skip all of that for you. Okay, and here we are. It's gonna set up some more things in the background, but we are already set. And you can see it automatically sets the resolution for your retina display. You go then to settings because I assume that you also want maybe to play some games from Steam to install them. Um, if you check for updates like this, you won't see anything. So you have to go to Windows Insider program. You have to sign in to your Outlook account. Just make sure that you actually activated um, the Win Windows Insider program and once you log in um, you can here activate the beta channel and then make sure that you hit that um, marker up that you want to have the updates for the dev channel and then after that you will receive this update here you have to install it and then restart and after that you're gonna be able to install normal 64-bit games from Steam he's just gonna install the, from the toolbox from Parallels and now I'm gonna download Steam And I'm gonna be trying to already install one game. I already tried it with one game with Left for Dead. It was working without any prompts. It was just like sometimes having some big spikes, but um, in the beginning. But after that, it was running quite smooth. Um, but 
I'm gonna show you more about the games in the next video. I'm just gonna show you that here's now Cyberpunk 2077. I can install it like in a normal Windows PC. It's gonna be installing the game. The only bad thing is you cannot play it. I tried to launch the game. Like you can actually launch the game, but it's just gonna be loading long time and then it will just go to this black screen and then you are gonna think it will start but at the end you will just get disappointed <laughs> i don't know what the exact problem is but i think maybe uh, because of the graphic card drivers because they are just standard display drivers so yeah that's for the quick video for today thanks for watching like and subscribe if you like the video and check out my next video for gaming on parallels bye